part of my responsibilities are for the reliability of service to our customers. And when we sit down with UVA and they begin to describe the impact of the fluctuations in our service reliability, what they had to them as a customer in medical and trauma and research, uh, other healthcare operations and types of uh, activity, it became very apparent that the overhead facilities that were serving UVA weren't going to meet their needs long term. The issues at the, at the health system uh, were uh, you know, power outages, power blinks, but those very quick blinks tend to create havoc, make equipment reset, um, some of the larger equipment, air handlers, med vac pumps, those kinds of things in the hospital um, that would blink. They'd come right back on, but they would have a reset period, and so that kind of creates a problem for operations all the way down the line. We established what I think was a really a strong partnership with Dominion on approaching uh, the issues and uh, came up with the solution of putting in an underground service from the Dominion substation to our primary two substations on our campus. As we selected early on that uh, we wanted Dewberry to be our partner with this from, as a design consultant. It took a lot of collaboration between Dominion, UVA, and Dewberry to say, let's optimize this. How can we manage reliability, exposure, cost, and really optimize the infrastructure project overall? When I'm you know, driving back to Richmond from Charlottesville, I'm thinking about the project and what we've accomplished, but I'm really thinking about the people and what it took in those relationships, the human element, to get the infrastructure in place. So I'm, I'm proud of the partnership. Our relationship now with the uh, Dominion Center Regional Operations Center is such that we're able to, they call us as soon as something happens. Before, we never knew what caused it. We knew that something happened and that it was, it was fixed. But now they call us, they're watching our lines, they're calling us as soon as they see something happen on our feeds, and then we know, we can report it out. And this, this whole project, it's going to just, most of our events are caused from something happening on the line or something happening on another line in that reclosure. So isolating us and putting us underground, the benefit is just gonna be enormous.